Hi everybody, it's Amanda here at the Budget Lab. I left you guys last week with my November goals where I said, oh, I'm gonna post twice a week on YouTube. And then this past week happened and I didn't post anything on the normal days that I normally do. So I'm sorry, I miss you guys. I had just, it's full-time work, full-time school, and just full-time family and just life got in the way. I got a lot of new subscribers over the past week. Um, so I want to say welcome and if you are returning welcome back if you haven't subscribed, please do uh, Let's do that real quick All right here is My awesome little tracker and I've lost my markers already <laughs> So I have a little over 80 subscribers Like no way I was talking like I was so excited when I had like 20 <laughs> And now I have 80, 81 or 82. So we'll color in terribly my tracker here. This tracker is from D versus Debt on her Etsy shop. And as always, since I'm doing this, I will link it down below so that if anybody is interested, they can hop over there and get one of these. And I actually have. 50 hours of watch time. We're filling in one of these for the first time. All right, awesome. Tracker number one done. <laughs> and a mess happening just over here on the side that you guys can't see. So today I'm gonna cash stuff my paycheck number two for November. We're gonna count up what I got, make sure it's what I need, and then we'll get, we'll get rolling. Hundred twenty forty sixty eighty one hundred twenty forty. 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40. Look at that. I wish 100 plus 140, 20. Let's move everybody a little bit. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So we are just stuffing this week two hundred and sixty-five dollars. Whoa! What was that? All right, that was the weather radio beeping at me, telling me I had bad receptions. Let's get started on this cash stuffing. So the first thing I'm going to stuff is groceries. Groceries is getting one eighty. So let's make sure one hundred twenty, forty, sixty, eighty. Yeah, I didn't get to make my normal videos this week just because everything that's going on. Um, Y'all will remember if you watched my video several videos ago when I talked about having to have a spinal tap, I had to do that because I was having some numbness and tingling and that sort of stuff going on. And my neurologist called and has diagnosed me with multiple sclerosis. So I am working through adjusting to the fact that now I'm gonna have to go on medication and this is a chronic illness and, but it explains so much. Like, oh my goodness, explains the fatigue, you guys, which is why we end up purchasing takeout sometimes because I'm too tired to cook. <laughs> so if you guys have any, ooh, if you guys have any um, recipes like that are good to make ahead and keep in the freezer for nights, it's just too tiring to, to cook. Um, I want to know because right now this is what ends up happening. But this is not getting any money. It is empty right now. So it is just, it's out of here. But I don't think we'll need takeout, especially with this coming week with Thanksgiving because we'll have leftovers, which I'm really excited about. Gas is getting $40 because I am really close to ending. So, probably gonna fill up later today. Dog is gonna get 10. Yeah, this whole uh, new diagnosis is just, it's interesting. I, 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 I've never really, I've always been like really healthy. Like when I went to the doctor to have my spinal tap done, they were like, do you have any allergies? Do you have any medications you take? Do you have any other illnesses? And I'm like, no, 
fine, no medica no medicines, no, no problems, I have nothing. And they're like, why are we doing this? <laughs> I'm like, that's the point. I, I'm, I'm finding out what's wrong, but it makes sense now. Dog currently has 25 in it. This is household. Household is getting $10 added to it. Let me move stuff over. So now I have a total of 20, 30, 40 in household, which is good because as we get closer into the holiday season, I'm gonna need, like I need a new doormat because I wanna have is really ugly and stuff like that. That's the kind of stuff that this is for. Clothes is just getting $5. So it has a total of 10, 15, 20. And let's see, family fun. I put money in last paycheck because I'm only putting in five, like $5 a month because we're just gonna use it for doing something fun. We've actually figured out what we wanna do. Once my son, he is eight, is fully vaccinated, we're gonna go bowling. So we're gonna put this money towards bowling. I stink at bowling. I have to have the bumpers in there. You guys, it's just tremendously awful. Speaking of my son, he's getting $10 put towards his savings, which gives him, oh my gosh, let's put this in here and count it. 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. If you haven't watched any of my other videos, my son is like about half the age of my daughter, so I have longer to save for him until he's 18, so he gets a little less than she does, just because I have less time to save for her. She's getting 20, so this is 20, 40, 60, 80 in her savings. And then I have $10 left, and this is for my savings challenge which is my one, every week I change, and then here come all my markers rolling in. Every week I change what I save. So the one Friday it was $1, the next Friday it was $5, the next Friday it was $10. So I've already done one and five. I did an extra two bucks up here for the budget lab. And this week I'm gonna add $10. Okay, so I'm gonna add $10 in. Let's see if we can get my money in the jar here. So, so far, I have saved 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, $18. That's exciting. I told you guys, I have no savings challenges, you know, for the end of the year, but this is what I'm doing. I'm loving it. It's fun. I like watching, I like it. I want this to get filled with cash. <laughs> okay, you guys, so, oh my goodness, everybody here. Holy cow. Make sure I got all my envelopes. Yes. I got my tracker for my savings. Got my tracker for my people. Envelopes are filled. I would consider this a win. I feel very scattered today. I think that's part of what's going on. Did y'all hear that? That's a stupid weather radio. It's yelling at me. Okay, I'm gonna uh, end this before it starts alerting like crazy. All right, you guys have a wonderful Saturday. I'll see y'all next time, bye.